Hi, thank you for watching today. I am going to show you how to take a regular SVG image that is one color and make it into different colors but making sure each of those colors are able to be grouped together onto one mat. So what you're going to want to do is find your SVG um, image that you can use within Cricut um, your Design Space and you're going to open it up here insert the image into your project and I actually was kind of testing things out and working on my options so I have two dinosaurs here I am just going to use the dinosaur with the bigger pieces for this tutorial so what I'm going to want to do is make a copy of this dinosaur. So I'm going to copy and paste. And now as you can see I have two different dinosaurs here. So let's say you want to make the dinosaur yellow and blue. Um, I'm going to want to take one of the dinosaurs click contour at the bottom right down here and I'm just gonna click every every other piece so if I want this one to be yellow blue yellow blue yellow blue um, yellow blue however you wanna oops, however you wanna figure it out so you're gonna click the opposite uh, some of it might be hard to figure out here you, know, you just want to click the opposite um, pieces in this puzzle here. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with this right here. Maybe I'll maybe I'll do that. So you can see that they're kind of alterna alternating in and out here. And exit out of that. And there's one of the dinosaurs. So then with this one, you're going to want to click that one and click contour again. And you're going to want to select the opposite ones than you did in the first dinosaur here. So it's going to look more like this. And I kind of forgot which ones I did. Mm -hmm. Yeah, which ones I did over here. You can always exit out of there and see. Let's see. Oh yeah, so I need this one. Not those. Okay. Yeah, it takes some getting used to. And playing around with it to really figure it out. And you can go ahead and change one of the dinosaurs to the color you want. So let's say you want it blue. Change it to blue right away. And you can see, I think I might have forgot a piece down here. You can check on the progress. All you got to do is put the little pieces right back on. It looks like one of these pieces are going to have to be blue. The bottom foot here. Oops, I accidentally changed it to yellow. Let's go back in there. You can always get back in there if you make a mistake. Click on the piece and change it. This one's going to be blue. Okay, there we go. So we have our blue and yellow dinosaur that started out with just a yellow dinosaur, which is pretty cool. So when you print this or cut it onto a piece of vinyl it's going to cut out just like it shows here with each piece put together so you can just lay it completely on top of the other color so it turns out evenly and things like that um, actually I forgot another little piece right there there we go There. Perfect. Um, so that is how you do it. Makes it a lot easier 
rather than trying to situate each of these pieces within a shirt or a project or whatever you're doing. Um, if you have any questions on this tutorial, please let me know. Comment in the comments and I will try to help you the best I can. Thank you so much and have a great